What's going on YouTube? My name is Diesel and today, whoa, I missed my turn. Hey, <laughs> we're back in Farm Simulator 2019, baby. Woo, ha, ha. Just hanging out here, down on the farm here in Rustic. The Rustic map. Rustic Acres. Stop, we'll stop. Let's go ahead and we'll stop. We'll pull away. And we are in the brand new Seasons mod, which came out over the weekend and I missed it and I apologize, but we're back into it on updated Rustic map. And we're getting after it. Our mod for the Seasons app, we've uh, changed it to six days, six day seasons. So right now we are in the planting stages. It's lovely. Now we're about to hit the summertime. Summertime, some, some, summertime. And then when we get to around day number five, so we got like another, uh, what day are we in? We're day five right now. So we're going to take another 10 days just to get to the place where we can harvest, except for our grass. We have planted a bunch of grass. Where's the grass at? There it is. We planted a bunch of grass so that way we can sell grass, we can sell uh, silage, we can make silage. Uh, we also have our animals that we need to mess around with, which we've already had stocked up from previous, but it's mostly, all, all, except for all of our piggies. Our piggies, I sold all the piggies because grass, uh, for sheep you just need a bunch of grass and water. And for the moo cows, you just need straw, grass, and a little bit of mixture, which we have all set up over here for when the time comes. And our chickens just need water, and they need wheat. Wheat, I tell you. Wait a minute. So I have a whole bunch of equipment that we have set up for, ready to rock and roll for our field. Our fields we have currently... Uh, field 32, 45, we put wheat down, 32 is grass, and we have bought the farm. We bought the farm, everybody. We bought the farm. And in these three little mini ones, this was going to be the focus of our day today. And this map also has an updated hemp. And that's what we're growing right here. It's a super plant. It's a super plant, y'all. So... What we're going to be doing today, though, first I have to go ahead and gather the bales because I made that one field grass and it's already grown and we've cut it and harvested it. Now we just need to get the bales loaded up here. I'm strong like bull. Ugh. Come on, let's move it over. Nice. Now let's head on over to the field. We'll snag up the bales, and we're going to place down vineyards, my friends. Yes. It's gorgeous. It's beautiful. It's lovely. It's going to be quite the moneymaker, because all you have to do... Hold on. Hold on. Let's see. Operating position. Nice. When it comes to the vineyards, it's not like the old vineyard. Uh, the vineyard that we had in 2017 was basically you planting down an entire mountain, and then having vineyard uh, b uh, vines beautiful grapevines it was a it was actually a pretty wild model uh the problem is there's just <laughs> it was so big it was so giant you had to find it, it was basically you m building an entire mountain there we go and then you had to have something that was kind of tiny but a little strong and able to go up and down it to try and gather some stuff and uh to to, to seed or water uh, actually, I believe you uh, have to go all the way to the tippy top, drop in water, and then drop in oh god, manure, manure or slurry. And I forget how you har. I think you harvested it by like just taking a machine and running through it. It was kind of a giant pain in the butt, but. Transporting position, we are no longer in need of that. Let's go ahead and unload the bales. Can I do that? There we go. Down we are. And like magic. Or like magic. Die. Like magic dog. Don't even trip, dog. Hit return. Now I've sold all of the cotton equipment, so that's all gone, and we replaced it with normal harvesting equipment. A couple tractors. One harvester, this diesel designs harvester. I mean, you gotta go. Sometimes you just gotta go for it. And now we also have manure getting thrown in from the moo cows. There it is. Manure going from there into that little trailer right there. And that's gonna be our craft slinger. Like web slingers, but like they're 
call them crab slingers. So if you go into the placeables, miscellaneous, you have your choice. There we go. A bottle of red. Bow, bow, ba, bow. A bottle of white. Bow, bow, ba, bow. I said we get. Uh, I said we get two of them. Let's get two of them. And you don't have to worry about planting it on the side of a mountaintop. It'll fit right here. Right here. I got your, I got your vines right here. Um, this is winter mode compatible or seasons compatible. So hopefully, let's get out of here. Come winter time, we may see a little bit of frost. I'm actually uh, anxious. Got a whole bunch of snow plowing mods. It's going to remind me back in the days when I used to be a landscaper. Just plowing out all the businesses in the town, which I don't even know how many we have. And we'll make that pretty here. Let's go ahead and we'll hop on in. There we go. Let's just paint it down the center lock. All kinds of pretty. Oh, don't want to go too far into the into the vines. Let's go check this out. Okay, just had to smooth it out here a little bit because we had quite the lip going up into this. It was kind of a mess. It was like a harsh a harsh cut. And I think it's gonna work fine, especially for a tractor. That's good. 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 So. How the vineyards work. Dump manure in here, drop water in here, and it earns you money over time. It's not gonna be something where it pops out uh, barrels or buckets, or any kind of pallets for us to ship over to like a winery, because there was a, it was two different kinds of mods. There was the vineyard itself, which was a giant mountain, and then there was an actual wine uh, factory that would give you pallets that you can then sell to you and yours but we don't have to worry about any of that. This will make it all for us. Some mysterious workers will go in there and tinker and toil and go ahead and grab every single one of these little tiny grapes once they start popping up. So we have a little bit of manure. We definitely have a bunch of water. Let's go ahead and fill these giant these giants up here. Yeah. I think that's all we need. Let's do it. I don't think this is gonna work. We're gonna need a side tipper. Yeah. A side tipper or a telehand or yeah. Hmm. Okay. All right. So, round 2. I've also got a little little belt system right here to make sure that it all works out the way we want it to, baby. Uh, and I do have this going out the left. Yes. Do I have to get close to it? How close do I have to get to this? Close enough that it's not silly. Give me a second. It is a little uneven. That ground is super duper uneven, bro. I'll have to even it out. Hmm. There it is. See, we're supposed to hit that trigger. All right, let's just scooch this up a little bit. I had to change our tractors here because the wide tires that we have on our Big John is a little too big. And that only holds 3,000. Good, 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 good. Good, good, good. Let's flip this around. And let's get real tweet. Tweet like a twigger. Beautiful. And that way I don't have to get a front end loader or a belt system. But what we could do, instead of just having this truck here, or this trailer, I could dump a whole bunch of manure at the end and set up a conveyor belt system that goes along a long line of these vines. Ideas. Problem would be trying to get to the water source. Eh, something to throw throw around. Some some Something we could throw around the idea. Now let's go ahead and we'll drop some agua. Let's see if this uh let's go see if this triggers. I'm so triggered. Uh new. No. Yes. <laughs> now this is one that I used for our dairy back in the day. It's a dairy tank that holds milk and agua. 
A little bit of H2O. High, high quality H2O. But it did have a couple of uh, troubles triggering some things back in the day. So I don't know if it's going to allow us to trigger this. Aha, it does. Beautiful. Now if I hit N, doesn't... Okay, so it doesn't need to cover. Whoops. Hey, hey, hey. How much water does it take? Oh, look at how the vines just perked up like that. Oh, look at all these grapes. Kind of look like pineapples shaved off, but you know what? From afar, it looks like grapes. If you get up close, pineapple or beehive. Let's go see what the other ones look like. Turn around. Now, it would be nice to have an actual factory. I'm not sure if it goes like... I'd like to build up the meats up in this section. Nice. Get our beef production up. There's no meat packing or any kind of slaughterhouse or anything like that. The mods have not come out yet. Uh, most of the modders would know better than I. Or what the issue may be. But that looks fancy. So now, as long as we keep manure and water packed into this section, doesn't matter if it gets low or if it gets high, it'll still produce the same amount per farm. What is that, you may ask? That's a good question. I don't know. I keep on hitting escape, and I'm not, I'm not sure why. Well, if you go into the placeables, it'll tell you. It'll tell you. In the miscellaneous. Boom. $90 an hour costs $10 per day. $90 per hour. Multiply that by 24. 24 times 90 is 2160 bucks. So you'll make around four grand. Just as long as you keep manure and water piled up in those sweet, sweet vineyards. So good. Now, will it uh, keep on giving us that kind of money in the winter? <laughs> I don't think so. But I'll be too drunk. I mean, uh, I'll be uh, too uh, rich to care. So, I'm going to give this a little bit of time. I'm going to turn this off here. And we'll speed this along. All of our crops are planted. Now, we just gotta, we just got to harvest them. Keep an eye on these animals. Ah, uh, yes, a good day for a mow. Early in the summertime. Summertime, summertime, some, some, summertime. I'm feeling good. You're, you got a lot of work. You got, you got a lot of, lot of mowing to do. We need to try start trading some of these things in for cash. We got to bail them up. Wrap them up. Try to make up for the amount of money that we're losing when it comes to having all of the animals in our stables. Ah. Telling you though, nothing's better than mowing a lawn on a beautiful summer afternoon, which is something I have to do later on, which I'm kind of not not looking forward to. I like in this game, <laughs> it, take, it takes a, a couple months for the grass to grow. If only that were something that happened in real life, then all of us, all of us, all of us would be happy. All of us would be totally happy. We still complain about it when we had to do it though. Like, one, had to mow once per month. We still find some way, some way, shape, or form for us to be unhappy and not want to do it. But, since y'all been gone, I have purchased two more vineyards. Oh. Oh, we're fancy. I'll tell you what, man, that thing goes quick. All the manure is gone. Come on. There we go. That's the ticket. There we go. <laughs> if it wouldn't be for the props, this would be so easy to do. But no. Gotta put us to work a little bit. Watch out for the big bump. Oh god. Oh god. We'll have to even that out. But I do want to stretch this entire field out. To be nothing but vineyards. It's a dream of mine. It's a goal. So that, that way when the winter time comes, we'll be drinking nothing but sweet wine. Probably not sit on a whole lot of cash though. Absolutely not. We'll be struggling, but at least we'll have something to do. And that's drink. No, it's playing. But seriously. We can drink. We can drink if you want to. Pa pow. Only filled up with about a thousand. So that's no buenos. That's a no buenos. Now, how much water do we have to give them yet, still? 
go ahead. We'll hop into the truck. Let's go. Now, can I load this up either way? Oh, watch out for the tractor. Watch out for the tractor. Can I load it up on either side? Beautiful. We can. Yes. That is good. Now, that didn't need uh, too much. That's good. This is a fresh one now. Okay, 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 okay. Wrap it around. It's gonna blow up my transmission. Eh. All the shocks are gone. And we'll dump the rest of this water on here. And then we'll fill it back up again. But baby, let me see. Let me, let me take a look at this. This is pretty sweet. Rows and rows of vines with a big hill. Watch out. That's okay. I can deal with a big hill. Technically, we should have these on a giant hillside anyway. So having it tiered like this for them is fine. But then we'll have to just even out the roadway, the path, the dirt track, whatever you want to call it. But this is working out just fine. Just fancy. Uh, we are still losing money because of the animal upkeep, so it's going to be tweet until the wheat, until the grass is harvested, and then we can snag up some bales, sell some of the bales, throw some into the feed mix, so that the cows still produce poop. Now, as far as the wheat, we do have to wait for the wheat to uh, do its thing, which is just grow. I need it to grow. I need it to grow now. And the hemp. Ah, oh, the sweet, sweet hemp. Now, how much money can we get for hemp? How much? How much cash are we looking at here on a new crop such as this? On a super plant such as that? Where are we at here? Not a whole lot, but I'm not sure how much it yields either. So it could be something where we get thousands upon thousands upon thousands of it, and we're getting 1,600 per, uh, per thousand. Or if it's something we don't get a whole lot of, and... It pays us that much, which I can totally see happening. I'm not quite sure. I'm not quite sure. We're in the early summer months. We're in day two of summer. Oh, these piggies. Soon we'll get the piggies back. We'll get the piggies back. Where is our... Yeah. Speedy mower. Speedy mower to the rescue. But folks, it's a quick little episode. We got our vineyards. We got them rock and rolling, ready to go. And I think they look fantastic. And they're yielding... A bunch of cash for us for 24 hours which is helpful in the summer months now we're gonna run out of food we're gonna run out of wheat so the manure is gonna go down on the moo cows um, we didn't have any any poop from the uh, pigs which is another reason why I got rid of them we got slurry but they this thing doesn't take slurry it only takes manure manure is only in the moo cow section I did uh, purchase a horse or two so that, that way um, we still have our horse helper who trains the horses so we have that cost on top of our animal upkeep so it's a bummer, man. It's a real bummer. But once they're all trained up, we'll be able to sell them for a nice chunk of change. And we have our free-range chickens, baby. Cockadoodle-doo. Why, hello there, ladies. Oh, you're the cockadoodle-doo. What's going on, man? <laughs> all right. He's fancy. My man. On cue. Almost on cue. Work on your timing. But we're getting eggs. Not a whole lot of cash for these eggs, but... Every little bit will help. But folks, that is going to be your episode for today. If you enjoyed this video and you want to see more, by all means, hit that like button. Helps out my channel ever so much more. You know, I also added this silo. We need it. Just in case. Just in case. Just in case. You never know. Uh, helps out my channel ever so much more. You know. And if you like it a whole lot, go ahead. Hit subscribe. New videos are coming out every single day. Every single week. Folks, have a great day, afternoon, evening, good night. As my voice completely cracks. I'm a mess. I'm a mess. This looks fancy, though. I like it. I do. Peace out, like shout y'all, and I will check you out right here again. Farm Simulator 2019, maybe it's Seasons Mod. Next time. You're so fancy. Everything's going to be so lovely, so nice. It's beautiful. It's gorgeous. Gorgeous.